Here is the rest of example D and E. Okay. Um, <clears throat> let's bust this guy out. The boat has a velocity of 5.43 meters per second. It's pointed straight across. We've got the current, and it crosses in a certain amount of time. <coughs> so that's this velocity here is 5.43. That's the boat pointed straight across with its velocity, right? Um, the speed of the current is 1.45 meters per second. Um, the time is 72.0 seconds. Okay, and then um, it, basically we just need to find the x's, it looks like, right? So this is a crazy one. They're totally independent. Remember from our little triangle, x is v times t. Right, so uh, 5.43 times 72. Let's bust that out. That's 390.96. Right, so that would be 391 meters, and that's our first answer, right? That is how wide the river is, right? Uh, how far downstream will we be carried, right? Well, that's going to be uh, 1.45 times 72, 104.4, right? So 104 meters like that, right? So um, the boat's velocity, our, our problems will always be pointed straight across. So this is always the boat's velocity. This is always the current, right? And we always use this. So th these are not so hard.